All right, welcome back. We're not down there. It's, I don't know, it's probably in the mid 40s. I'm already shivering. I just got this fucking camera set up. Ooh. Little drill, little drizzly out, and I don't see Jack. <laughs> just got him some carrots earlier, so yeah, tropical beer hug, 9.9%. Uh, this came in a multi pack. This was the highest percentage, and uh, well, first beer of the day, and it's like four. In, in the afternoon, so not in the morning. I don't think it's ever four in the morning in this bright. Oh, guess I could show the color, not like if I give a fuck. I mean, it's yellow. All right. So there's been 6,100 check ins, 9.9%, 45 IBU. Uh, this big 9.9% Imperial IPA is super juicy and bursting with tropical flavors. Just a thing to accommodate a swing in the hammock. Do I need to say what the temperature is again? <laughs> Has that typical heavy malt forward, heavy grain forward. I'm sorry, but I'm fucking dying. I might go get the jacket in a moment. Come on, hoodie. Piece of shit. There we go. So... Maybe a little citrusy. Honestly, it smells rather awful. Kind of has that... Says it's good till January 23rd. I wish you motherfuckers would just tell us the can on date. Unless it was canned on January. <laughs> this is an old fucking beer. It's almost the end, uh, the end of November right now. Alright. Tastes better out, better out of the can. That's the first time I've had it out of the glass. Blah. Uh, very smooth for an IPA. Not too bitter. A lot of fruity notes without being too sweet. Tasty little imperial. This person gave it a two, so they're they're not a fan either, so. Certainly upping the ABV on this hug. Not sure if it does much to move the needle. Clean, clear, and crisp, hoppy, and dry. Of certainty. What well, you do, you're speaking Greek. Sailing the open seas once again. Brad. No one cares. Hope you, uh, hope you sink. Oh, so good. Big bear hug. Eh. I'm, I'm not really too keen on it. Out of the can, it was a lot better. Out of a, a tulip. <coughs> Not really that much flavor. It seems like it's uh, just a very heavy, like multi forward. All right. They got a 3.74 out of 5. I do 1 through 10, so that's going to be right at 7.5. <coughs> I'll agree. I mean, it's not terrible. 9.9%. It's drinkable, but not the greatest flavors, I guess. Alright. So, there you go. I was going to do another beer review, but I don't think I'm going to. <laughs> Alright, tomorrow you'll see us out here, hopefully with Jack. But, uh, we'll be seeing you.